in here being no fun. Tristan Surge Reckoning. Tries for being incredibly unfunny. Chance of crossing the line. Mentally unstable. A seagull impression. An inappropriate moment. Consider dangerous and annoying. Then six years of kidnapping. That's just bonkers. Let's see, expand it. Still not. And our power just went. Logistics. Nope. Let's see. Wait until this. Oh, it also controls the water supply. Let's switch on. I'm guessing we're going to need a quick build utility room. Send some capacitors to this. Look, I don't think they're necessary. See, we got visitation. Yeah, what's that sapping sound? Mm. These dormitories are still not enough. Capacity. Expand to 80 cells. Unless these all need to be spells. The basic cells. Building them. Okay. We've got power up and running. And a separate grid, it looks like. Like they're improving, they just need to be cells and not dormitories. I like it. Kind of in the midst of being built. Execute your workers. That's good. Take some of license plates. What's this? An incident. Joyriding and murder. Why does he keep the little drug symbol on him? A prescription? Does he need a prescription or does he have a prescription? Or maybe he just has random drugs on him. That could be a thing. Three days without incident. Let's see. Uh, this is our optional we need. Yeah. No. Staff.
and cast 100 a day. So yeah. And they're sitting. Oh, they're stalling the filming, I think. automatically lock open. Yeah, I'm guessing it built. Sleep. Too early tree. Okay. Let's see. So I keep the audio keeps fluctuating. I'm trying to move in my chair a little bit. Try to stretch so my legs don't fall off. Quick bill. care of the family I think. Now we just need to finish off building our capacity. Oh, you can bend it now. Let's see, I've got all the beds and stuff. Oh, it's Officer Kien. Sorry, sir. I ought to know there's been another suicide. Looks like one of the prisoners and just a rat poisoning. Dr. Hertz is on the way now to confirm. Oh yeah, he's probably running because he probably... Yeah. He knew it probably been the tattoo boy. Yeah, the picture. Yeah. And I figured it was him. Isn't she the most beautiful thing ever? He's alive. I think she might be. Never too late to change a life, sir. And I thought he was the one who killed himself, but it was someone else. 
big difference. I think we've made a big difference here. We've given the inmates something to work towards, a reason to keep going. You can stay and help us see the first branch of inmates through educational work progress. It's up if you want. But I think we can handle it from here. When you are ready to leave, click on the Polaroid in Morgan's cell. Uh, uh, let's see. Next chapter of the story. And the rest is just up. Oh. Bootstrap. Pretty sure there's only five chapters, though. CNDC. Today, in CND News, a special report into the states of our prisons. It's been two years since the infamous Deej Alcimeo claimed so many lives, including the chief exclusive Charles Walson. Today, we hear from leading experts and ask what, if anything, has happened to change those tragic events. We have to go live to our state's longest running prisons. Recently scheduled for demolition. Live now, only on CNDC. Uh, yeah. Report. Thanks, Sarah. This prison is housed in some of the country's most notorious criminals. But now the walls are being torn down to get a new prison complex. If you look behind me, you can see the construction crews are already here. The demolition has began to work. Joining me is the Mayor Calvin Heller. Thank you, Mr. Heller, for taking the time to talk to us. It is my pleasure. In the past, you've been a strong advocate of a tougher, more disciplined approach to prison management. My demo, a facility that, which has been defined for so long as a punitive approach. Both the prison and the operation has been quite antiquated. Took some decisions to replace it with an entirely new facility, one with more, more policy. Just in on the news a few years ago, as one of the last remaining state's execution facilities. Com Campaigners have lot sought to revoke the death penalty here. Will you honor their wishes, or will you build the execution facility? I still under reveal. That is not a decision we'll take lightly. Thank you, Mayor Heller. Back to you in the studio. This is CNDC News, reporting live in the state of the prison system. After the break, we'll join the Dr. Helter Hutz, a specialist in prison psychology and rehabilitation. Let me congratulate you on your appointment as CEO as doing a fresh start. You have the complete autonomy, more or less. More prisoners hire, we offering rates, we have a lot of challenges ahead. As for the death row facility, tear it down or keep it. Or make some use of it. It's really up to you. Somebody else. If you won't. As for objectives, I'm giving you the same as you gave your predecessor. It's entirely up to you how you achieve them. One last thing the previous CS. Oh, Charles Wallace. I'll find a letter that he used to give out to any new prison architects who joined the firm. He had some good advice. You may find it useful to look at. Good luck. Zero board day, prison is closed. At least 100, balance is 60.